All right, uh, Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory be unto Yahweh Bahasham, Yahweh Shai Bahasham Makar Kodash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone that rule well. Peace, salutations, and blessings be unto the hopeful elect. Pushing his truth in sincerity throughout the four corners of the globe. In a sincere hopes of being delivered in these last days. All right, this is the Bobby Akanan from the GMS England branch. And, um, you know, as you can see, this is going to be um, a brief in transit video. I'm not going to make this too long, uh, Lord willing. You know, as always, it's edifying onto you brothers out there and few sisters listening and also learning. All right. Now, um, inspiration for this video is um drawn from you know a video that i was watching a few days ago from elder apostle taha all right and it was um concerning you know statements that were made by the iuic and you know the um the um statement you know in regards to great millstone you know us at great millstone not helping the community okay and, you know, as Elder Postaha, you know, titled his video and was going into, we are not set up to, um, to help the community, all right? Yahweh, Bahasham Yahweh Shai, did not set up the prophets to help, you know, the community or the so-called, you know, black community, all right? Now, what the Lord did set us up to do is to uh, preach, okay, and to herald in the return of our Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shai, okay, that's our job, all right, is to go out there on the highways and the byways and to preach this word, now does that mean that, you know, we are not um, charitable men, you know, of course not, within the body, you know, the brotherhood, you know, is, um, is, 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 is founded, all right, upon charity, you, you know, and the um, the um, the common belief in Yahweh Shai, okay, that's the foundations, you know, of the uh, brotherhood, man. Okay, so charity is very present now. Concerning those that are outside, you know, of the body of Yahweh Shai, we show our charity through. The word, all right, through preaching the words of Yahweh Barshim Yahweh Shai, okay, and as the scriptures say, you know, the greatest gift, you know, is the gift of prophecy, man, okay. But not only, you know, just going out there on the highways and the byways and um, preaching this word, but preaching it the right way, all right, coming in the true spirit and power of Yahweh Barshim Yahweh Shai, okay, and that's why you will always hear of us defending the gospel. All right, because you can't preach this word how you want to preach it. All right, and that's exactly what a lot of these other congregations are doing. They're preaching the word according to how they want to preach the word, and they're omitting vital pieces of the puzzle. All right, which in turn is um, taking you further and further away from Yahweh Shai. Okay, and that's why the, the scriptures say, though they draw near me with their mouth yet their heart is far from me, okay? And that's, that's hey, that's the IUIC, all right? That's, you know, these other, you know, false, you know, congregations, you know, filled, you know, with false prophets, man. That's exactly what they're doing, all right? They're leading you further and further away from Yahweh Shai. Well, first of all, they don't preach the name. They're not coming in the name of Yahweh, why Yahweh Shai, all right? They're coming in the name of Christ and Jesus, okay? So, you know, right there, you know, that's strike number one, okay? They're not giving you the names. They're not giving you the um, appropriate access codes to even be acquainted with, you know, the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, okay? So straight off the bat, you know, those, those, that's, that, you know, those are strikes, all right? Now, what I'm going to entitle this video, all right, is... um spiritual bread is better than carnal bread okay because 
you know, the spiritual bread, all right, which is representation of this truth, which is representation of Yahweh Shai, all right, which Yahweh Shai, you know, was the manna from heaven, okay, and that goes, you know, that goes back to um, John, uh, the sixth chapter, okay, so we represent, all right, in Yahweh Shai, we represent the, the um, dishing out, if you will, of the um, the true bread, you know, which is Yahweh Shai. Okay, that's what we represent here at Great Millstone through the spirit and power of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai. Okay, we don't represent, you know, giving you carnal bread. And again, that's not to say, you know, that we are not charitable. That's not to say that we don't help people, all right, in our own uh, personal lives and, you know, situations might arise and, you know, you, you know, charity, you know, gets shown. But the highest form of charity, all right, is really preaching the words of Yahweh Barashim Yahweh Shai. That trumps everything, okay? That trumps what you could give someone carnally. That trumps, you know, uh, setting up a stool and giving someone a plate of food, all right, physical carnal food, and, um, you know, a piece of, you know, physical and tangible GMO bread, okay? <laughs> What's more profitable is actually giving someone the truth concerning our Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shai, spiritual bread, okay? And even going back to, um, what's that? Um, I know I'm jumping all over the place, Salakia, but I just want to get everything out, you know, why it's in my mind. Going back to um, Matthew 4, with um, Yahweh Shai, you know, being tempted of Satan, okay? What did Yahweh Shai, you know, say unto uh, the spiritual demon Satan, okay? He said, you know, man shall, not, not, shall, man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word, okay? The words, all right, of Yahweh Bar Shem Yahweh Shai, okay? So that proves to you right there, when you go to Matthew 4, that the um, spiritual bread trumps the carnal bread okay so it's not all about um you know going out there setting up stools all right and giving people gmo bread that's not what it's about at all man okay and there's nothing wrong with doing that but what trumps that is spiritual bread and the preaching of the words of yahweh all right that's what trumps all right what they what they you know the spirit that they're trying to push concerning great millstone all right it's all about the spiritual aspects okay of this of this faith which they which they lack all right which they severely lack all right they severely lack the spiritual aspect concerning this ministry and what it's all about okay so we're all about feeding you all right the true wisdom knowledge and understanding of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai that's what we're set up to do, and that's what we're going to continue to do through the Spirit, man. Okay? You guys can continue, all right, with your 501c3, you know, to hand out, you know, physical and carnal bread. Which really, you know, that's to, um, that's to, um, what's the word I'm looking for? That's like a, 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 a covering, you know, over the eyes of the people, all right? When, you, you know, you're handing out, you know, bread. You know, you're giving out food, but how many of them people are really sincere and really want to learn, you know, about Yahweh Shai? Okay, how many of them people really want to learn about Yahweh Shai, man? Okay, and that's why you have all kind of madness happening behind the walls of the IUIC because you got a lot of members in there that don't even, you know, know what this thing is really about. That don't even know, you know, why they're, you know, standing up wearing purple, man. They have no clue. Okay, because they ain't really about. Yahweh Bar Hashem Yahweh Shai. They don't know Yahweh Bar Hashem Yahweh Shai because they haven't been taught unto them. Now, of course, you're going to have, like we always go into, you're going to have sincere members, you know, of um, of the IUIC, all right? That, you know, are going to be of the elect and that will come out of that, you know, madness, you know, in due time, you know, when Yahweh Bar Hashem Yahweh Shai sees fit, Okay? But the bottom line is, you know, you you guys are not coming in the spirit and power of you. How about Shimmy Shai? Okay. Now, um, hey, even um, when we go to uh, uh, in the book of Acts, you know, concerning uh, Peter. All right. Uh, what did he say um, 
to the um, the lame man. You know, he says, silver and gold, you know, have I none? Okay, so this ain't about, you know, having, a, having an abundance of money. All right, this ain't about, you know, having the ability, you know, to feed people carnally. It's about having the ability to feed people spiritually through the spirit and power of Yahweh by Hashem Shai via the word. That's what nourishes him. All right, it's, it's more important to nourish the spirit rather to nourish the, um, you know, the physical body, man. And that's what we, we are to focus upon, man. All right, so I'm gonna cut it off there. You know, Lord willing, this uh, this brief lesson was edifying. And until the next time, I'll say shalom.